So we wanted to deliver them something different, something creative. And one of the things that we kept talking about was every great horror film kind of exploits your safe space. So you know, Jaws did it with a day at the beach. You have uh, Halloween, which did it with, you know, the babysitting and the neighborhood setting. You had Nightmare on Elm Street in your dreams while you're sleeping, right? Psycho did it with simply taking a shower. Um, and the list goes on and on. So with Stream, we were saying, what is something that everyone kind of feels safe, but also questions the unknown about? And it's like, that's a fine line. And technology was something we kept coming back to, right? Our phones. Everybody feels safe behind their phones. We put all our information in here, but who's really getting it, right? Who's watching us? Uh, is our Alexa listening to every conversation? Everyone says, is the government hearing my words, right? Uh, and it's that level of privacy. So that was the start and the birth of it. Um, and the dark web and now the cryptocurrency thing. So that was a lot of things that came into play. However, we did want to make a slasher film. So we mixed the two kind of ideas into something we think is fresh and, create and creative. And what the storyline is, is it's about a family that is having some problems like your average family everybody's got problems and they're having problems with their teenage daughter and they decide to recreate a trip from their past a vacation from their past uh kind of like the wally world uh, vacation kind of situation where it's like okay mom dad kids let's go let's just take a break from our busy lives and try to reconnect as a family and see where we went wrong. they go to this hotel that they went to this um, kind of uh, resort kind of place that they went to and it was their last well-known best vacation but everything is kind of in the process of being modernized in the process of being changed and it's under new management and what I will say is that four serial killers are released into the hotel and the whole place is on lockdown and they're kind of playing a game of who can kill the most guests in the most creative ways all while uh, being videotaped and I'll leave it at that. Hey Fiends, Donna Jean here. Thanks for joining me for that shot of espresso. If you would like to hear my entire chat with Michael Levy and hear about the ins and the outs and the gore and the indiegogo and the perks and the celebrities, click on the link that should be showing up about now. Mm -hmm.